there are um, three things, uh, three objectives when we talk about this. Degeneration, deflation, and descent. And focusing on degeneration, lasers are very, very common. Yes, lasers are very common, and they have just gotten so much better over the years. Qterra is a maker of um, various types of lasers, and they're really leading the charge in terms of you know what their lasers are able to do. From a relatively non-invasive um, form to you know pretty substantial repair work that still actually works with the natural fibers in your skin at a very deep layer to you know stimulate collagen and tighten things and lift things and improve skin tone texture it can um, improve acne scarring, yeah, get rid of... It can of, be really yeah, useful. Sun damage, pore size, all that kind of stuff. It's important though to note that not all of these lasers are created equal, so that's the myth out there. So ask and make sure you're getting the best stuff. Qterra is the one that is all the buzz right now? Yeah, uh, Qterra is the brand and they make various types of lasers oh, okay. depending on what you know it is that you want to target. The pearl laser is, is what I'm being told is, is is the up-and-comer. Yeah, okay. the pearl, there's two kinds. There's the pearl and the pearl fractional. And basically the pearl fractional is a more invasive form of the pearl. There it is there. There's an example of a before and after which is which is remarkable. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so with the pearl there is um, there's what they call social downtime. So basically means you're gonna be you're gonna be quite red and peeling for about three to five days after your treatment. Um, and so, and you really want to stay out of the sun and mm -hmm. realistically you can't go to work or leave your house. A lot of women will say no pain, no gain though. Yeah. <laughs> if you look that great afterwards, um, it's, it's, a, it's a good option.